sit down and just for a second you got to play something else for me how about that ladies and gentlemen a, a man that has definitely saved my rear end i'm getting married on october the 22nd to that beautiful young lady back there with a hat and they have arranged an air show with a flyover that day hugh come out here right quick everybody say hi hugh, hi, hugh. thank you ben you know, after that reaction that this crowd gave me to God bless America, I do believe I'm in a free speech zone. And right now, unless you're an NFL quarterback, I'd like you to rise as we present the colors of the United States of America. What? Let's see if we raise that rebel flag back there. Huh? That rebel flag back there. <laughs> oh yeah, they raised it. These young men and women are from Palmetto High School. Air Force Junior ROTC, that's Reserve Officer Training Corps. Many of them will go on to be Air Force officers and they will be flying the, and maintaining the aircraft to protect our skies and give us the freedom that we enjoy as we stand out here today. Right now we're going to be looking skyward for the Special Forces Association Parachute Team, which will be coming in here in just a moment. They're going to be landing over near the kids area because obviously we've run out of room here on the, in the amphitheater. Boy, I tell you what, Anderson's turned out here today and we're really proud of it. Our jumpers today, the first, the last one or the first one to open will be Mr. Ron Alley, who's from Honeyapout, South Carolina. He's a retired special force. That's right, give him a hand here. He's a retired special forces soldier, has more holes in him than Swiss cheese. Our second jumper, will be John, Joe Rich, he's from Orangeburg, South Carolina. Joe has 700 jumps. Ron, by the way, has almost 6,000. Retired Master Sergeant Rob Scott from Sumter, South Carolina. There you go, hey, we got anybody from Sumter? All right. Please take note, Glenn, we got some people coming in here. We've got Chris Serene, excuse me, Chris Serene from Somerville, South Carolina with 3,200 parachute jumps. And let's put it together for Mr. Peanut Page from right here at Anderson. Yeah. 2,300 jumps and he is our tandem master. And we're gonna tell you a little bit more about that here in just a moment. The Green Beret Association is a organization, a 501c3 organization that supports our special operations soldiers that are currently deployed to over 120 countries around the surface of the earth. Each one of those men and women are helping protect us so that we can gather here today and breathe that sweet air of freedom that we have here in Anderson. Now hopefully they're not lost in the crowds, but we're gonna see them here in just a couple of minutes. All right, if you look right straight up, you can see our first jumper coming out. The second one coming under canopy. All right, we got three more up there. And now, ladies 
ladies and gentlemen, let's salute the greatest country on the face of the earth with the national anthem of the United States of America. to 24 miles an hour and with no wind here on the ground it's going to be an interesting landing ron's working his way right over there and there he comes in our other jumpers will be following him in they've gone to school all right we got four more jumpers to get on the ground and we've got one that's carrying a passenger ben not you well, our other jumpers that are coming here, Mr. Robert Scott, Air Force veteran, Joe Rich, a DOD employee out of Orangeburg, Chris Serene out of Somerville, South Carolina, and Peanut Page, who is our tandem master. The tandem jumper here today is the executive director of the Anderson Cancer Society, Miss Angie Stringer. Now she's a cancer survivor, so I don't think jumping out of an airplane would affect her as our last jumpers come in for their landing. She deserves a round of applause! All right, if they're coming down, give Angie a big round of applause as they come in for their landing. Oh yeah! They can hear you up there so you can make lots of noise. All right, we're seeing here. Ben, you got better eyes than, than I do. I believe Angie's under that green and white canopy right there, the green, red, and red. All right, Angie, bring it on down! All right, coming in for the landing now, they're jumping a great big parachute, but uh, Angie's lost so much weight, it doesn't make that much difference at this point, and they're coming down for a precise touchdown. It is a bounce house that she can be landing in right there, that works. Ladies and gentlemen, this concludes the presentation by the Special Forces Association. Thank you for being a very receptive audience, and God bless America! It's hard to top that. I just, sorry. I tell you who we can thank as you're sitting down right now. Put your hands together for Michelin, our title sponsor, and Tri County Technical College as our stage sponsor. Now, if I'm not mistaken, this young lady right here is from Tri County Technical College. And there are um, 
There are a few things in the world that people like to, to hear about, and that's number one accomplishments. Now, last year, Clemson University did not go all the way to number one, maybe this year, but tell us about the number one accomplishments right down the street. Oh, we have a lot of number one accomplishments at Tri-County Technical College, and all of you can be a part of that, too. We are number one in student success among all the technical colleges in South Carolina. We are number one in successful student transfers to four-year colleges and universities in South Carolina, and we have the number one graduation rate in South Carolina. So you've got a great little community college right at your back door with campuses in Anderson, Pendleton, Easley, and we're building a new campus in Oconee County as well. So we're here to serve your needs. We're affordable. We've got top quality education and great programs that lead to great jobs. Y'all enjoy a great evening tonight. Thank you. Thank you very much for coming out and thank you for sponsoring our wonderful stage this year. Let's give her a great big round of applause. Now you can take that back to your bosses and say, hey, we are good. There's some other people that we'd like to thank today. We'd like to thank um, Sunbrella, TD Bank, Electrolux, the City of Anderson, TTI, Goodwill Mills, Independent Mail, David and uh, Davidson Floyd, Waste Connections, Blue Ridge Electric Corp, and Ann Med Health. 